The Thesis Statement A Quick Guide The Purpose of a Thesis Statement All presentations or papers should really have a thesis statement. Your entire paper or presentation hangs on the quality of your thesis statement. This is supposed to be the main argument that you're advancing based on the research that you've done for your either presentation or paper. A thesis statement is trying to make a claim. You must be argumentative and not descriptive. And it should be single sentence, maybe two at the most, but always try for a single sentence thesis statement. A thesis statement has three main elements that you need to include. These are a context or focus, evidence drawn from observation, and a contentious claim. So let's look at a couple of examples. Context. In contemporary international relations, evidence, the failure to offer clear predictions, contention, undermines the scientific basis of realist theory. So we have a context, the study of international relations. We have evidence from observation, the failure to offer clear predictions, and we're making a contentious claim. It undermines the scientific basis of realist theory. The contentious claim can be disputed. Someone else can come in with alternative evidence and make a counterclaim. Nevertheless, your thesis statement should make a contentious claim. A second example. In the case of Russia's aggression against Ukraine, the continuation of the conflict by Russia, despite sanctions and isolation, undermines the strength of the logic of appropriateness in constructivist theory. So see how specific it is. Context or focus. Russia's aggression against Ukraine. Observation. The continuation of the conflict despite sanctions and isolation. Contentious claim. The undermining of the idea of the logic of appropriateness in constructivist theory. Again, context or focus followed by evidence through observation towards a contentious claim. Context, evidence, contention. It's really that simple. So let's try and make your thesis statements that little bit stronger. Include a context, which is usually your case study. Evidence, which is in the case study, or at least you can go and find evidence relevant to your case study yourself. Contention. Based on your observation, what claim are you making? And that is the thesis statement.